Nein, bro, I just missed it. Oh. I got one, I got one. I just got to my place where I will camp for the night and I see you tomorrow. Good morning. For a while now I had an idea to go fishing at sunrise, but knowing myself I was sure no matter how many alarms I set I will still not wake up next day. So then the idea hit me, to go a night prior and sleep in the car. This way I can wake up before sunrise and be already there at the fishing spot. But then I faced really quickly some other obstacles. My line somehow snapped, I had hard time finding spot where I sleep and not knowing basically anything about these waters. But everything will change really quick. First thing first was to spray myself against the mosquitoes because there are just incredibly many mosquitoes here. But now that I'm safe, we can start our trip. I have two fishing rods with me. One I have with the float and I have a spinning fishing rod. But I'm gonna test this one first with the mosquito on it because on the mornings I think the mosquitoes would be a little bit better and if not then I will put a worm and I'm gonna try my luck with the spinning because I have some nice under three places here it's also not a lake it's like a, I don't know how it's called in English it's like a steady place but on one point it meets with a river so it's kind of fresh water the good thing in this place is you you never know what you can catch because the fishes are just, just moving around, entering and exiting. bite but it was between it took it between the branches I think because it was stuck There is a lake on the other side of this mine, they mining sand I guess from the lake. So let's drive around and take a visit for this lake, let's see what we can get. I'm gonna pack my road and I'm gonna try the, the lake, maybe I have some more luck. Look what a beautiful spot I just found, I mean, look at this. <laughs> Okay, let's try our lock somewhere else because on that lake we had just zero chance to catch something. So let me just squeeze myself in here and hope for the best, I think. This is fresh water, it's not lake, 
so I hope that here will be a little bit more active fishes or something let's see I don't know how deep this water is but I think it's not that shallow I, think I should make, make, make it deeper let's see how about that catch me outside how about that There is a big fish right near my throat. It's going for it's coming this side. I don't know if you can see it. It's like this big. Come on mate. Don't let me down. <laughs> They're jumping around here. But no one will to bite my bait. Nine, bro! I just missed it. Ah! Oh. When I turned on the camera, I missed it. Fuck! It was such a beautiful piece. From now on, I leave my my camera turned on. Oh, I have goosebumps. What a beautiful piece I got. Damn! I thought I hooked it right, and I can turn on the camera. I don't care, camera stays on. Damn, what a beautiful piece I hooked. And I just missed it because I thought I can still turn on the camera. Oh, hopefully I can catch another one. Damn, my adrenaline went crazy. I don't think I ever catch such a, such a beautiful piece. Come on, once again. My first bite for today and I missed it. It was already here in the bushes here. Man, what a dumb I am. I could take it out and film it afterwards, but no, I had to keep it and turn on the camera. Stupid. I got one, I got one. But this is not that big as the last one. Look at this piece, what a beauty. Hey, 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 calm down. Look what a beautiful piece. <laughs> That was awesome. I really hooked it well the fish because I struggled to get the hook out of his mouth from his mouth so there was no way to lose it but I'm still mad because I lost the bigger one because I was dumb anyway lesson learned oops that wasn't that nice of a throw Let's see this side a little bit. Right there. Another like five pieces like that and I'm good to go home. <laughs> it's worth it to come out today. Nice. I wonder how I could get to the other side where that tree is on the lake, on the river. I bet there I could find some other nice pieces. I have to check the map who I could get on the other side. I think the 
two fishes I just got. I mean, one I got and one I lost. They did a little bit of mess in the water and they scared the other fishes, but we keep trying. If not, I will change the bait. But I don't think the bait is the problem because I just got one with this one. So it works. Maybe a small fish would work better, I think. So I won't go back now. I just found this spot, it's a really nice spot. And after I came on foot in the wet uh, grass, I saw that a little bit further, you can enter easily with a car and you will end up here in this same spot. So I guess lesson learned. And next time I know where to come. Look what I found guys. It's full with grass underneath the water. I took my frog. Let's see if we can catch some bass or something. In this side or even here in the shadow. I don't know if there are any basses at all, but I hope so. Oh yeah, I throw it all the way on the other side. So I think this was for today's video. I had just one catch, but it was a nice piece. Not the jumping <laughs> when I left. So thank you for watching. Make sure you subscribe because I had a couple more adventures planned. And if you don't want to miss it out, hit that subscribe button. Like the video if you want because it helps the channel. And see you next time. Bye bye.